do not weep. The widow of Nain lost her only son and no one to take care of her. There is nobody for her to share her grief with. The widow of Nain now found herself spiritually, socially, and financially destitute. The widow of Nain was facing a future without hope. She was a dead woman, walking, alive on the outside, but dead on the inside. The widow of Nain had done nothing to merit a miracle. Instead, the Lord took the complete initiative. The widow of Nain doesn't even know who the Lord is. The widow of Nain is about to receive a grace inconceivable to her sorrow. The widow's darkness was turned into light. The widow's sorrow was turned into joy. The widow's son was restored alive to her. We can rejoice because the Lord seeks us out wherever we are and restores us for eternal life. When we experience that kind of grief, we always feel completely alone, even when surrounded by a lot of people. We are dead in our sins, and no one can help us but the Lord. It is nothing we do, but only the compassion of the Lord that brings us to life. So many reasons to despair in life have no human solution. We find ourselves so powerless to help others. The Lord had compassion on the widow of Nain and performed the miracle without being asked to. The Lord who in his compassion can change our lives for the better, giving us life and joy. The Lord comes to heal and to restore to life. Let allow his compassion to touch our wounds. The Lord gives the widow of Nain a reason to turn her sorrow into joy. The Lord arrived at the right moment, the Lord came to the widow of Nain in her time of desperate need, and he will come to us as well. The Lord joins us in our tears here and now, but the day is coming when all our tears will be wiped away. The Lord met the widow of Nain in her darkest moment and he will meet us. The Lord is going to take the deadness and turn it into life. The Lord offers true life to all those who want to follow him. Our words and actions can bring life to someone who feels dead inside. In the Lord, we find hope and new life. With the Lord, nothing is impossible.